Tonight, a Land O'Lakes mom has a warning for families. Beware of caterpillars, one in particular with poisonous hair that sent her son to the hospital. Our Melanie Michael on the case tonight. Mel, I saw these growing up in Lakeland, so I know they pack a powerful punch. I'm quite sure you did, Jen. Good evening to you. I want to show you what this looks like. This is known as a pus or asp caterpillar. Very furry and very dangerous. And this mom tells us the next time she and her son Logan do yard work, they're going to use these and wear gloves. This mom describes this moment as eye-opening. I mean, I've seen furry caterpillars, but never seen this one. And um, apparently, like, they are around and they're dangerous. Andrea Pergola had no idea what kind of damage a creepy, crawly caterpillar could do until she saw the wound it left behind on her son's wrist. The fur itself is poisonous. It has the poison, but then there are venom glands that each spike is attached to. This is where Logan and his family were doing some volunteer work over the weekend, landscaping in rural Zephyr Hills, never knowing that nearby in an oak tree, a furry tiny insect was lurking. He came running towards me and he's like, something bit me. And he showed me and it was like all welted up. And I said, okay, well, let's go inside and we'll like rinse it off. But it was too late. The toxins were already in Logan's body. An angry rash traveling up his arm and onto his chest. It numbed my whole hand and pretty much the whole thing felt like fire. Luckily, an ER was nearby and Logan got help immediately. The family even brought the bug in a baggie and the doctor knew exactly what it was and what to do. As for Logan, he's got this advice. Wear gloves and like long sleeves. Great advice, Logan. Keep those gloves handy. By the way, this 15-year-old is doing well after that visit to the ER, where he was given a high dose of Benadryl, some steroids, and anti-nausea meds. But it still took a matter of hours for him to get back to 100%. Certainly something to look out for this summer, especially you, Jen, seeing those growing up. Keith, you mm -hmm. too. Look out. <laughs> we'll be on the lookout.